Oh, good, Mill again! Hello, everyone! Lionheart here. You asked. I'm here to deliver. It's a Nilfgaard list. This season has been very interesting for Nilfgaard. Double Cross Assimilate has fallen a little bit by the wayside, albeit there is a Singleton Shoop Rune Mage list that I'll be bringing you at some point, but... I then saw this list by everyone's favourite potato. It's Crozier! Oh my word, this list is incredible. It is double Golden Necker Siri Nova, and it has so much power, so many decisions to make, so many different lines to victory. He is currently at 2550 with this list. When I heard that, I thought, I have to try it. It's decent active counter meta to the recent meta snapshots that have been put out there. And honestly, well, what more is there to say but take you straight through the list. So here we are, and here is the deck list. As I said, Golden Necker, Siri Nova. Now, there are a couple of cards. He referred to it initially as Soft Mill. I want to clarify, this is not Soft... There is no Mill! Well, okay, there's a little bit of things that might Mill. There's a T-Bore in here, and there is also a Vilga Force. Even, dare I say it, a Cantarella. But they are designed to be paired off with things like Gors for Kved for really, really clever little combos, and they are situational combos that will open up and present themselves to you. You are gonna see some of the craziest plays I think I've ever made. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, it, you know what? You're just gonna have to wait and see it. There are some interesting tech choices in this list. Surrender flat out allows you to beat dwarves on its own, very simply. This list thins so well. This card just beats dwarves on its own, which is a little tragic. The Teshen Mutna Sword is a tech I thought we'd see a lot more of across this season with all the Siri Novas around, but haven't done so. But the beauty of the way this game works right now, the Mysterious Puzzle Box allows you to have situational techs that in certain matchups you know you're going to trade away for a 13 provision token. How incredible is that? We even have a Divine in here for additional Purify value. It's not really much better than a Pella for a provision more. The Assimilate tag with three, maybe four procs isn't necessarily something you'd normally run, but honestly, we had the spare provision, so why wouldn't we? He, uh, there have been a couple of changes to the list later on that Crozier considered making in the seven provision slot, perhaps running a profit, for example, or maybe even a black blood, as crazy as that sounds. But let me know what you think of this list in the comments down below. I had so much fun with this, and I'm definitely going to be returning to it. There is so much power and potential in this. It is not the easiest to pilot, so definitely watch all three of the um, of the games here. And drop into his channel as well, twitch.tv forward slash crozy. He piloted this really, really well. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please do drop a like on it and subscribe to the channel. There is so much content coming, including all of that new starter content that I've told you about. If you are newer to the game, we have so much coming. I hope you enjoyed this, guys. Love you all. I'll see you next time. You've got so many different lines to winning with this. That's one of the things I really enjoy about it. Uh, what have we got off the books? So, open deck list week tells me that this is going to be in the meta snapshot. You're not terrible. Uh, Vilgaforce round one could be really good for us here. I feel like I'm mulliganing the surrender against this. Uh, I'll find out, Shemesh. I'm not sure. I'm not 100% sure, my friend. So, blue coin, you're always pretty happy to open Nilfgaardian Knight, because its downside disappears. Probably, the, I think it's the last one. I think it's the purple one, bud. Renounce a scene! Yeah. Yeah, Surrender is good against the Disciples, yeah. I feel like there's going to be a lot of value of it whenever I play it in this matchup. Both Disciples on the same row, round one, is kind of wild. Uh, Fallbound, thank you for contributing to the workout goal, my friend. Really appreciate you. And sad song as well. Thank you. Mm -mm 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 
Nice. Oh, this, yeah, this is non-devotion. This is the, um, gold, this is the, yeah, golden necker version, I think. Didn't... You think they're playing champion? Be a first time I've seen it, but you might, maybe. Okay. Now, I, I, I guess I play the Siri here. Keeps me ahead by quite a distance. I probably flip the lamp as well. I don't want to play the Ring of Favor yet. I can always get the Surrender if I choose to from Arcane Tome. I'm trying to think, what can this list do to, to kill this? Tempo-wise, that's a lot of points, right? This is their last turn to... Off the books with both of them. Wow. Yes, you. Have you made your offering? This is ballsy against Nilfgaard. I'll give them that. They're just hoping I have no poison, right? And they're not wrong. Hmm. Decisions I have to make here. If I'm going to play, I need to Arcane Tone the Golden Necker basically now, right? I basically have to Arcane Tone Golden Necker here. If I'm going to fight out of this round. So that's what we're going to do. Not locking, it's a mistake. Apparently so, yeah. Uh... Can't leave brothers on the board? Evidently. God. Oh, this is all terrible. I'm ahead. Okay, so I could have locked this. Chose not to. I feel like they give me this back as well. That create was terrible against Syndicate. Absolutely terrible for us. Lovely little combo. <clears throat> okay, should have locked both of these long ago. That's not really a surprise to any of you, but... <clears throat> I feel like Surrender now from this could be good. Right? It also will just destroy itself, I think. It will destroy itself because their row is full, which is quite cute. sure I can win this round. The swing there was reasonably decent. Ring of favor for ring of favor is fine. We don't mind that. And now, now I can choose. Vilgafors on a 17 feels pretty amazing, regardless of what we pull, right? Also, if they're running this, so I just have, I Vilgafors every day here. There's no version of reality. I could. No, that doesn't make any sense. Um, Quite the menial task. I'll take that. 
And the beauty of this list, I can put Golden Necker back, right? So we win the round. I also win the round with carryover. Obviously, they take carryover off board, but I take it on board. Uh, so my Teshin, sorry, my Arendite is already at eight as well. So um, I want to make sure I have. Wonder if they run sensor. I, with the list they're playing, I'm inclined to say probably no, but it's weird to see them run the brothers both um, without jackpot for the benefit of over-profiting. But... You're going to be useful. Um... I'd be surprised if they're running it. So, I'm going to start by putting the Golden Necker back into my deck. Magic dies. This world dies with when I play Gorthric of Ed, I'll pair it with this Fist Tech Trafficker from there, so that Tibor plays for 10. And at the moment, my first Erendite's looking mm, pretty tasty. Shady Vendified's poison. Very good. Love to see it. Love to see it. I say no thank you to the poison. Every time I played this card on melee for Fist Tech, I never found it early season. It was very frustrating. Mm. Okay. Too soon. I figure morale just dies now. Emo! Hey! How are you doing? Great to see you. Welcome in. Lovely to see you. Hey, I've got a whole new starter set coming out for Gwen. Right? Lovely to see you. How's your day? How are you doing? Hmm. Super excited for it. Awesome! Yeah, when it comes out, I'll definitely 100%. I promise I will let you know. Promise I will let you know. Maybe I, maybe this is my lock. Is this my lock, chat? It could be my lock, click, T-Bore. It could also just be my Erendite. I think it's my Erendite, right? I'm going to say it's my Erendite. Let's go. Uh, yes, welcome in. Really nice to see you in the channel. This, uh, yeah, it's, it's definitely changed a bit. Visually, um, it's... It, it's upgraded a little bit. The card art in this game will ruin every other game's card art for you. I, pr I, can, only, I can tell you that much. I can tell you that much. Uh... Epic Scene Stinger, thanks! I love it. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I guess I just play this for seven now, right? I think I just play this for seven. Hold off on the T-Bore again. Because we're ahead by such a gap. T-Bor's playing for 10 and this is removing their tallest card. Uh, I, I feel like we're in a pretty good spot here. Um, we get the Golden Necker. Nice. Huge swing though. Yikes. That's... Okay. Okay. Terrible Erendite and Candle. Right. I never yen this. I never yen this, right? Because it's a six. Where's Cantarella? Uh, sat firmly at the bottom of the deck, as always. Um, I'm only behind by five. This will put me up by five. So, still no spender on the board. Okay. Obviously they've got this, but I can't do anything about the Conjurer's Candle. Conjurer's Candle's a fantastic card. Yen the 12. If I Yen the 12, it'll delete it, but won't give it to me. Which is fine, and an option for sure. Uh, yes, this Spender's fantastic. Where am I from? I'm from England. I'm from... I don't... 
How well do you know England, Emo? Are you, wait, are you from England, actually? You could be English, right? Are you English? Hmm. Mm. Oh, yeah, I was going to say, you're not English. You're Finnish. You're Finnish. Um, I dress like an American. I'm just wearing a t-shirt. <laughs> and the t-shirt says Frankfurt on it. Um, decisions I have to make here. This puts me ahead, but I never keep the card. I feel like this also clogs my deck a decent amount. So, uh, if I take this, I'm up 8, 9, 10, 11. But with the spender, it's... Basically, this is find Golden Necker and still win. Where's the suit? I am not suited today. It's so warm in England today. If they have another poison, it's redundant either way, right? Because I'm going to be up 8, 9, 10, 11. Okay. I take the pass. I'll take the pass. Maybe the push was wrong. Maybe pushing into this round was incorrect, but with all the things I got, I feel like it probably wasn't. I don't know. They still have a full leader, which is a bit scary. With Last Say and Conjurer's Candles carrying over. I'm a bit nervous. Eh, yeah, there he is. Okay. So, we have this and this and these. I want Cantarella here though, right? You're about to read the Witcher books. Excellent. Yes, I have read them. I have read them. Uh, it's been a while uh, since I've read them. But yes, you should. You should definitely give them a read. You should definitely give them a read. When you know your Witcher well enough, maybe you can appear on my Witcher quiz show. Mm. Once you've read the books, if you've played the games, if you know the TV series, maybe, just maybe, you will be able to prove that you know the Witcher. Oh, I love it. Oh, the Siri is gonna get yeeted by the Tesha Mutna. Now you're motivated. It's what we like to see. Hmm. So, open Cantarella or open... I think I open Golden Necker, right? Golden Necker's so many points here. The happiness of drawing the right cards. It's called talent, my friend. Nice. Excellent. Superb. Yep. Yep. Mm. Yes, we play, yes, against real players, yes. Always against real players in the quiz. There's, uh, we've got quite a lot of exciting stuff coming where the quiz is concerned, for sure. Although when, when I actually play, when you actually play the quiz, each of you play individually and then the wonders of editing puts you against other people. Um, so you don't have to worry about them being around, if that makes sense. Salamandra hideout, okay. I just lock... Oh, no. Locking this... So I lock this and it doesn't purify itself, right? But I also kind of want it to keep growing, so it doesn't really matter. I should be your eyes, my lord. Opponent! Come on! There we go. Uh... No, this is not the same. It's built from the same principle because it's the same people and it evolved, but it's way more complex. Witcher 3 Gwent was, to be completely honest, um, have more spies the card game. It was definitely a mini game, an amazing mini game, but this is a fully fledged, in its own right, wonder of card gaming. Okay. So, what do we think their remaining two cards are? Because I can't remove everything. Oof, Erendite's massive here. I could lock the Salamandra Abomination. Right? And I think... I th think I Erendite this turn. Yeah. 
because I want to yen whatever is tallest, right? So... Okay. I maybe didn't need to lock there. Okay. They sh are they going to full spend now? Okay, fine. Brilliant. Thank you very much. Oh, this is going to be close. So we always take the spender here. And we hope they can't make 11 with no coins. With... Yes! Victory! Uh, nope. Uh, nope. Okay, well they were the easiest mulligans of my life. I've seen Mill running collar. But yeah. So, I'm gonna set those as some of the goals. For the, uh, for the subathon. Oh look, it's V going to... Mm-hmm. Fascinating. Yeah. Okay. Hey, <laughs> you love this stream? We're fun today. Hey, we try. I always boost this because it's just irrelevant, right? Who's that Pokemon? <laughs> Who's that Pokemon? <laughs> of course, Nickers comes out to save the day. Let's go. Hey, uh, Peleo, you never need to apologize. Your English is infinitely better than my version of whatever language you speak. Trust me. What is your first language, my friend? Okay, Crozier was saying to me that I want these cards out early because we mill the mill and lower the average rate of good cards in their deck. He's better at this than I am. We do early lock on Vigo. I kind of like that, actually. I don't hate that. I, I don't hate that. So I could lock, lock, which is double removal. Right. I really like that. And then I'm going to take... And I'm going to say we're going to T-Bore. Right? I think I now T-Bore. Maybe they yen it again, Keck. Okay, I like that line. I think that line's fun. I'm definitely on board with this plan. Okay, another Kingslayer for... Ah, oh, boo. No, this is not Mill. Mill's legitimately in the meta snapshot. One of the funniest deck guides I've ever read, by the way. Um, it's a little awkward now. Right? Because I don't want this. I don't want this or this. If I play Arcane Tome, it will it will encourage them to yen the T-Bore, right? If I give them this, they will yen my T-Bore. So, I'm just going to play a Diplo. I think I play diplomacy because Keck. The trap has been set. Yennefer! Oh, Yennefer! Uh, look at the top three cards of your opponent's deck. Hey! Don't actually do things. That's cheating. Oh. Really? What did the... They didn't take the bait. Hmm. Sus. Do we offer it again? I mean, okay. I'm now milling myself quite dangerously, right? 
Like, I'm milling me here, okay? Viper student's probably a good idea, yeah. I should just play the Viper student. The Adept, right? I should play the Viper Adept. Um, I can also then do some fun combos. This is just worth it. I, mm, no. <laughs> okay. We're substantially ahead. The Golden Neck is... Hey! Stop doing... Th oh, wait. Forgot they had a stratagem. Boom. <laughs> That's why they didn't take the bait. Oh. Oh my. Thanks. Long live the Emperor! Oh, how am I supposed to make this into a YouTube video if all I'm doing is laughing? <laughs> huh. YouTube, I clearly forgot to edit that out, so hi! <laughs> oh boy. It's just a great Vilgaforce target. Fact. It's all part of the strategy. I Vilgaforce this and I Yen this, right? Do I ever put Treherna on top using the Gothra Gaved so that that's what they get? Or do I not want to do that because I want to make their list worse? It doesn't get me ahead, right? I think, yeah. I think we want to just... Alright. They also choice. run Golden Necker. That's a good point. Naturally. Okay. So we're not ahead here, but that's fine. We don't need to be ahead. Um, in this situation. I I still have a Golden Necker to play if I choose to, but it's really risky. Ru Not Siri. Ha. I still could play my own, own Golden Necker here. For this, this, or this. But then I'm really dangerously thin. The problem is, I think I have to play Yen. And I think I just Yen the Snowdrop. Because it gets me ahead by a point. They will then play Ring of Favor. I will then play Ring of Favor. Okay. Yeah, they should Ring of Favor here. I don't think they've got a card they want to play that isn't Ring of Favor right now. He says, praying. That's a Golden Necker. Okay. That's fine. That's a lot of points. So now we may have to Golden Necker. Okay. D did they just create a Kingslayer? Time to get our hands dirty. Yeah. Before I commit the Golden Necker, do I ever Snowdrop first? Do I ever Snowdrop first? I could, I could a seer back yen right now. Do I a seer yen back to have a no? Because the erendite's fine, right? Screw it. That's not great. I divined this move from a sparrow's innards. Siri? I guess I keep Siri now, right? Nice. I'm invited to a session with Twitch. Sure. April the 20th. No, I'm not around! Ah! Why? I'm busy. Um, I've just got a... Oh. A ring of favor for ring of favor. We can answer that with our own ring, poggers. 
We may be losing this. This could be... Oh, chat, we might be in serious trouble here, huh? Because they also have Siri. Music marries cultures. Connect folk to one another. Um... No, it's like... No, no, no. I'm not invited to, like, a big Twitch thing. Uh... We get Arendite back. True. I get a seer to put something... Siri gets me ahead by one right now, but they have also drawn their Siri, right? If they've drawn their Siri, I lose by one here. Exub, thank you for the follow. So I have to pass here now. Oh. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. So I draw three cards here and I have a fourth because of Seer, but forfeit? No, no, no. We're not forfeiting. Hey, Mr. Habler, good to see you, bud. Long time no see. So... They might only play garbage. Yeah, that's true. We could still potentially win this, okay? Ring of Favor will, dis will disappear. Wait a damn minute. Wait a damn minute, chat. What am I putting back? Tibor? Tibor or Yen? Tibor or Yen, chat. They've already played their Tibor and their Vilgefors. So I guess Tibor? I don't want to clog with location because that makes their life better, right? Hmm. I'm gonna be- I'm ahead. So I, I don't remember what their Arendite was, right? In before Vivian! Who knows? It's possible. It's possible. Very unlikely. I can't stress enough how unlikely it is. I guess I open with Maxi then. Uh, mistrust, welcome to the channel. Thank you for the follow. Crikey, chat, we are we are the strongest card in all of Gwent right now. No, this one. We are 25 base power and 29 provisions right now. Chat, they just had to discard Roderick. They just had to discard Roderick. So we know this isn't a gold card. We know this isn't a gold card. Has Imperial Golem. So the Golem's paying for 12, right? Unless the Golem's in the deck. My only option here is Tibor, so... Oh, it's a special! <laughs> so I just play the two-point surrender, right? I play the two-point surrender. I don't, right? I have to play the Arendite now, because otherwise I might not get value. I have to Arendite now, because Arendite gets value on the board. Oh. Okay, show me 24 points. Come on. That's okay, that's half of them. That's four. Here's a chance. 
Yeah! No, wait, what's this? Oh, God. Oh, let's go. And chat wanted to go next. I'm going to be um, creating a whole new series of new starter content. We're kind of in the midst of making that new starter content for Gwent now. So it's a really good time to be considering getting into Gwent. Also, as you're all here, I am the host of So You Think You Know The Witcher. It's a Witcher-themed quiz show. Honestly, without overhyping it, because I have a habit of doing that, it's literally the best content on the internet. Like... Right? So, you, you have to check it out. Some amazing content creators and Witcher people on there. Staff from CD Projekt Red, uh, Gwent streamers, Witcher streamers, just Witcher knowers. You need to check it out. I don't think that was overhyped, right? And the guests we've got coming up, the guests we already have are amazing. Right? The guests we've got coming up... Oh my lord, I can't even, I, I can't, I can't, chat, I can't. You binge the entire collection? Nice, thank you bud. Yes, you got gifted the sub in one of the gift bombs. I underhyped it, see, I underhyped it. Hmm. <laughs> if it, okay, alright. If it was Henry Cavill, I would not have been able to keep it quiet with seven NDAs, chat. So, it's not Henry. Alright, it's not Henry. But I'm not going to say any more than that. If it was Henry Cavill, honestly, I don't think I'd have, like... I would say, arguably bigger than Henry Cavill. Oh, PW still broke my lighting. Look at this. How did you do that? Hang on. Better. Much better. Okay. I need to get Erendite to grow, but I'm not sure how I do it. Because I'm having to play quite slowly with things like Megascope. If I Megascope now, I might have a chance. Roach from Puzzle Box, maybe. Put that there for a turn. But what am I puzzle boxing? You know what I mean? I think I do this first. You think Mutna Sword? Are we not? Do we not think this is a Siri Nova? I guess it shouldn't be, right? The Knickers is just in here. This is self wound, right? These just make sense because compass, right? I suppose I have an answer to Siri with Diviner, so it's not... It's not the end of the world, right? So I'm on 16. <sighs> the problem is... I don't think tempo-wise I'm ever going to get ahead of them in round one. So I feel like I should just be trying to play for carryover and getting out. So I'm still happy to give this. But I feel like I'm never catching them here. So... Even though I'm on... I mean, I'm on 30 points, but yeah. Hmm. That's the new set of guests for this run, Phantom. I'm talking about the ones for after this. Our current set of guests are incredible. And the ones we had before as well. Oh. That's really slow, right? Interesting. <clears throat> so I can grow Tesh and Mutna Sword now. Right? I could Vilg the bear, which is pretty decent. Especially if I pull something they really don't want. It's a lot of tempo here. Potentially. Mm. No, tier 3 subs don't know the special guest. <laughs> or do they? Imagine you could find out. Okay, so that wasn't ideal. I was kind of hoping to mill something. Um, 
Tier 3 subs know the truth. Tier 3 subs know the truth, chat. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Tier 3 subs will even see a different version of this Lionheart card, so I've heard. Like, word on the street is that they see an even crazier version of this card. Just saying. <laughs> oh, you didn't need to gift a sub. Thank you for gifting it forward, my friend. Rob gifts you a sub and you pay it straight forward. Plain talk specky. Oh. Now this is slow, but I now have to... Oh, I now have to do it, right? 24 for 26. Broken. It's almost as good as the priestess. Ring first? Yeah, I guess I could ring, but the, if I ring, they ring, right? What kind of deck is this? Uh, Taximic, it is Crozier's list. It is a versatile Nilfgaard list that I would go as far as to say is counter meta. Uh, why am I square tell? Because I like square tell. Am I supposed to? I think I lock here now on the basis that I want to grow. I want their engine off, right? I want them not to have a pass. But I'll be changing the card. So the card you all just saw... Um, the card you all just saw is the first version of how that's going to look, right? Priestess is more than 24 for 4. Miles more than 24 for 4. They're getting pretty desperate if they're just jamming that, right? Blood. Blood everywhere. Oh. Makes me look like a lawyer. A crooked lawyer. How dare you? That's my casting headshot. What the hell, coconuts? Ooh. I could Gortha canter their compass. Oh, that's disgusting and I love it. You're irritated that my shirt is mirrored. Yeah, that's understandable. I'm always mirrored in this because it just... Because I'm facing this way. If I'm not mirrored, I look like I'm doing this and ignoring you all. So, because I spend all my time looking here, it looks like I'm looking across the screen. I guess I just give them the pass, right? How's it going? Well, it was fine until then. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, Coconuts. Welcome to the channel. Not a lot of... Okay, so they take the pass, which is fine. Um... I could yen their Siri for double Siri. Yeah, that's got to be right. We can put yen back with the seer. You know what? I like it. How different you look mirrored. Yeah, that's very true. Uh, oh, it's Burnley v Southampton tonight. Yawn. That could be a good game. I still can't believe Burnley sacked Sean Dyche. What's that about, chat? Weird champ. Ba da 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 da. Mm -hmm. We have the Cantarella. Okay, so. I'm looking for Siri now, right? I'm looking for Siri. So, oh, oh, in round two, being able to play one Siri and Maxi feels good. I need this. Is Gortha going? I think maybe I'm put. I'm getting rid of Gaved here. Okay. Yeah. All right. I'll open. Hmm. Playing Hollow Knight. Nice. Can't believe United haven't sacked Ralph Ranyik. No, they've given him a job upstairs. Mm hmm. Your manager isn't your problem. It's the entire structure of the entire club. Uh, they are... They go out and break some laws. What's your number? <laughs> no. Oh, God. Ghost of Tsushima is next. Bassicide. I'm so hyped. <gasps> oh, my God. I'm so hyped. Jerry. True facts that sound like bullshit. Number 69. I know off by heart. And it is a true or false question for chat. It is a true or false question. Humans are the only animal ever to have seen giving oral sex. True or false? You can run, you 
Draw, 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 mulligan, mulligan. So I get the arcane tome and this and this, meaning I get golden necker from this with everything left I need in deck. Of course it's false. However, it's fact number 69. Humans are the only ones to have been observed in the 69 position. Dolphins, monkeys, many, many other animals. <laughs> nice, that's cute. Mm -hmm. Hey, Yannick, how are you doing? I do look like a copyright lawyer, thanks. Uh, am I putting Yen back? I, yen back is a risk. Because if I put Yen back, I might miss Arcane Tome if she sits in the top half of my deck. And I need Arcane Tome to find Golden Necker. So I think I Siri now and worry about it in a little while. I think that's fine. <clears throat> no, no, Tommy, that's not what I said. No. Hey! Don't have answers, that's cheating. Just because I did it doesn't mean you can do it. Alright, so I want to get out of this round, so I'm pretty sure I'm playing Thing from the Box for the 13, put myself ahead by 10, and then we should be fine, right? Thanks, Yannick. Loads of new stuff. Yes, loads of new things. Um... Carpet smell, no. Behave. Good lord. Monka TOS indeed. Honestly. I don't want to YOLO Rella, really. I don't want to YOLO Rella. I want to steal one of their better cards when I Cantarella and pair it with Gortha Gaved. Am I ever lock? I'm not locking this, right? Oh. So I should have locked the Gremis because it would have got me ahead. Decisions. Lose the card. I can lose the card or I can YOLO Rella. YOLO Cantarella's kind of scary because I don't really know what they've got left. But I guess it's worth it. Just to trade another card from them. I'm never using the Aseer. I should be your eyes, my Oh! Alba! Hail Kerzer! Oh! And your power rate the Sarbones! Oh, 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 I feel like I need a shower. Oh, that's sickening. Oh, it's disgusting. Oh, it's hideous. Oh, oh, Lord. They've just given me Golden Necker. They just gave me Golden Necker again! <laughs> opponent, no! Oh, opponent, no! Oh, no. Your blade's just an extension of your will. Played a card yet? <laughs> oh, and I'm gonna put Yen back. I'm gonna put Yen back, right? I feel terrible. Chat, I feel terrible. That was that. I, if I don't get a Reddit post from this game, 
I'm never going to, right? That was, that was sickening. That was, that was filthy. Ro I mean, Roach was more points now, but it's, the Yen is just going to guarantee that I win the game, so. Right. I mean, they could, can they get out here? No shot, right? Maybe they can get out here. That's kind of scary. Oh, they said, yeah, only going to draw Echoes, but one of the Echoes is Comp- Oh, no, wait. They have to play Compass now. This- They have to Compass Lippy right now. Because otherwise they have no cards, right? And that's not enough points. Oh, they played it in- Wait, they played it in- They played it in round one, not round two, so their last card is Compass, I think. Unless I'm wrong, which I could be. And Lippy's not enough points. There's nothing that's enough points here. Is there? They need 19, right? They need 20 because of the bleed. So there isn't a 20 point card in the situation we're in. Fakusha into... Right? Boat is going to play for... 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Boat's only 12. Um... Kyalmar, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 is a max. Not enough. Yeah. Calculating. I feel terrible. That's... Wow. 